Hey guys, this is Krista Gem. Today we're going to take a look at the brand new 2019 Itasca Navion. This is the 24J model. First we'll do a walk around the outside and then we'll go inside and show you what's up. So first and foremost, you're sitting on the Mercedes Sprinter chassis. This is the 3.0 liter Blue Tech uh, V6 engine, 188 horse, 325 foot pounds of torque, plenty of power. It is a diesel, so you're gonna get great fuel economy with this as well. Uh, moving back here, you've got a nice entry step uh, to get in. Obviously, you can see on the outside, you've got a couple side windows with that overhead bunk. It's gonna be really nice and open once you get inside. You do have full body paint on this. Full, look how big this awning is. Nice big automatic awning. No more twisting and wrenching your shoulders anymore. Nice and easy, a one touch button. Moving along, we've got some storage along this side, some maintenance compartments here. We've got your generator here. Gonna keep you up in the, and boondocking or dry camping for a long period of time. Another storage compartment. For being about 25 feet long, you've got a lot of storage, a lot of capability to take a lot of stuff with you be on the road for a long time. And look at how big, if you can even see back in here, camp chairs, fold up kayaks, uh, shoes, whatever you need to put in here, uh, you've got a lot of space for it. Moving around the back side, you do have an, a nice rear ladder, making all that roof maintenance. If you need to brush off any snow, nice and easy to do. 5,000 pound tow hitch capacity, 500 pound tongue weight. If you're taking bikes or kayaks, things like that, you're gonna have plenty to be able to take everything. And also you've got an integrated backup camera, make these maneuvering a little bit easier. Also, if you are towing something, you can keep that on all the time. So that way you don't miss anything. Heading around the passenger side, got your maintenance compartment here where all your business is done, your dump station, all of that. Uh, data delivery, we can go over all that with you. You also have some more storage compartments underneath as well as propane. Uh, one great thing to, to mention while we're on this side, obviously you've got this nice big slide that's gonna open up on the inside. We've got slide toppers here. It's gonna keep the, your slide operating nice and smoothly over a long time. As you know, you're probably out in the woods. Maybe you are out with the snow. It's gonna keep everything off the top of that slide. Heading back, it just brings us back around over to the driver's side. Obviously nice and easy to get out from either side. Let's go inside and check it out. Hey guys, welcome back inside this 2019 Navion 24J. I'm Krista. We're gonna start in the front cab area and then work our way around. Uh, if you're not familiar with the Mercedes chassis, there's a couple great things about it. One, if you're a little bit taller of a, of a person, it's a lot roomier, you've got a lot more space, you're not tripping over things to get in here. This one is kind of great because they upgrade the uh, your entertainment system up front for your navigation, makes it super easy to see. It's not standard with this chassis. Another thing that this one does offer our cab privacy blinds. I don't know if you can see this. I'm gonna show you how this works really quickly if you can see. Basically, you've got some Velcro here, unvelcros, just like that, super simple. So you don't have to worry about the curtains in the way anymore. You've got pure vis visibility while you're out on the road. Up above, you do have this overhead cab uh, bunk area. Obviously, you can sleep some people, or I know a lot of people that just use it for storage. Even if you're not taking any extra passengers, look how much stuff you can actually fit up there. Obviously, flips over so that we've got some headroom to get out if you need it as well. If we want to move this direction, this is what makes this coach so cool. Uh, it is a corner bed floor plan, but look how big this U dinette is here. You can have everybody in, one conversation, one area. Maybe you're playing cards, having dinner, it's raining, as in the Pacific Northwest it does right now. Uh, everybody can be in here with a lot of room, a lot of space. These also pop up as extensions. If you didn't need that, maybe you're sitting with your legs out, watching some TV, plenty of that. A couple things to note about Winnebago. You've obviously got uh, storage all up above on all of these. In the Navions, this is actually like a yacht type cabinet. It's super durable, super heavy, super long-term. I guess would be a good way to put this. Heading back around here, you do have a convection microwave, so you can bake in here. Maybe you wanna make cookies, you can do it. You've got a nice big uh, armoire, nice big, what's the word I want? <laughs> hanging closet perfect so you can take all of your clothes with you in here are the cushions we didn't mention that for your front cab area these sit right on your your front seats because they both swivel again more people you can sit in here and back you've obviously got your sink here a little medicine cabinet for lots of storage more storage underneath you guys really can be out on the road forever you do have your bathroom here I'll let you take a look in here look how nice and bright and open it is plenty of room uh, get your business done, 
nice finishes in here as well over to the corner bed it's a down bed no more making your bed you can leave it down all the time maybe one of you drive in somebody's getting tired come back take a nap plenty of overhead storage up above separate fridge and freezer really nice again taking a lot of stuff with you here's where your maintenance control center is uh, this is where you're going to operate everything in your coach your slide outs your inverter all of your tank levels are all going to be from one area coming back into your kitchen area two burner stove propane also check this out stainless steel sink obviously you've got both sides so you're not having to wash and rinse in the same sink anymore again lots of look how big this storage compartment is lots of storage in here for something that's about 25 feet you're going to be able to go out for a long time Alrighty, again if you guys have any questions about this rv or any other one we've got here my name is chris died happy to help best way to reach us is at 503-668-5400 make sure you ask for krista